Yuyo is the state capital of Akwa Ibom, a major oil-producing state of Nigeria. The town became the capital of the state on September 23, 1987 following the creation of Akwa Ibom State from erstwhile Cross River State. The University of Yuyo resides in this town. Yuyo local government is a creation of statute of the federal government of Nigeria. It is by creation one of the 31 local government councils that make up Akwa Ibom State, which is one of the 36 state of the Federation of Nigeria. Its creation was a condensed account of political struggle of people desperately yearning to assert their identity in the political map of Nigeria. Many people see the political existence of Yuyo local government area, the Akwa Ibom state capital as providing the nucleus for the development of the people once neglected. An area in the southeastern part of Nigeria that is endowed with great economic potentials. Yuyo was first created as a province in 1959 by the colonial masters. The aim was to split the Ababio tribe into smaller administrative units for effective governance. The history of the Ababio cannot be complete without mentioning Yuyo local government area as the core or credit of the Ababios. Their origin to some sources is traced to central of Bainwe Valley, Talbot, while another source has it that the Ababio people migrated from the Cameroon, Henry now a pioneer Lutheran missionary in K.O. Dyke. Baini Floyd and another field informant maintained that the core of the Ababio people is the Afaha lineage whose original home has been traced to Yusak Adet in the Cameroon. Among the Ibibios Yusak Adet is popularly known as Etik Afaha reflecting that all Afaha people in Ibibio land emanated from, from Yusak Adet. A contemporary survey has it that there is no local government council in Akwa Ibum state that does not have one two Afaha villages existing within their constituted area. In recent times some indigenes have gone into transportation business, establishment of cottage industries for the fabrication and production of some household utensils and farm tools. On the whole they are very enterprising, innovative, and adventurous in nature. Besides, Yuyo people are property developers, craftsmen. They are also very enterprising, focused, and proactive. The city can be accessed by road via the A342 highway, as well as the Abak Road, Nwanova Road, ITU Road, and Aka Road. Nearby airports include the Yuyo Airport, also known as the Aqua Ibum International Airport. Yuyo is a fast-growing city, as the city has shown massive infrastructural growth in the past nine years. It has an intensive network of divided highways, such as the Nsikak Ejuak Avenue, an eight-lane superhighway which is currently the widest road in the Yuyo metropolis. Currently, flyovers are being constructed to ease traffic. Yuyo is home to the University of Yuyo, formerly known as the University of Cross River State. Its name was changed when, in 1991, the government of Nigeria established it as a federal university. Yuyo is also home to a campus of the National Open University of Nigeria and the Yuyo City Polytechnic. As a fast-growing city, Yuyo is home to many notable housing districts such as the Yuat Housing Estate, Shelter Afric, and other estates located in various parts of the city, as well as private estates and other residential districts. The city has two major industrial estates including the Item Industrial Estate. The city of Yuyo is notably neat and hospitable to foreigners and its aborigines. Highbrow residential areas in Yuyo include the prestigious Yuat Housing Estate, Shelter Afric, and a host of other choice areas in the city and its environs. The state government plans to construct newer residential districts as well as a central business district within the metropolis. The city boasts public recreational areas such as the Ibum Connection and the prestigious Le Meridian Ibum Hotel and Golf Resort which is still under construction and, when completed, will be the largest hotel in the West African region. The state has other recreational projects under construction, such as the Ibum Tropicana Resort, which will include a 16-story 5-star hotel, a dome, a cinema, a shopping area, water parks, and other recreational facilities. It and similar projects are expected to boost the tourism potential of the state. The city also has a museum.